It is day 23 of the 31 day Taylor Tone Total Body Transformation Challenge. And today it's all about the lower body. Now, I'll let you into a secret. I've already filmed this one and my legs right now. I'm standing here and I'm shaking so much. <laughs> so I know it's gonna be brilliant. You're gonna absolutely love it. For today's workout, you are gonna be needing a chair. If you've not got a chair, you need something a little bit sturdy this isn't the sturdy of things but it was perfect so something about hip height work surface in the kitchen edge of your bed if you've got quite a tall bed would be a good one just something that you can grab onto you do need that today and of course you need a mat or a soft surface something to cushion you from the floor the great thing about tailor toned workouts is you can literally take them anywhere with you and today is like that too You've got a bit of a shortened version on YouTube today, but if you do want the full length workout that's ad free and you want access to all of the 31 day videos in the challenge and you get a 31 day nutrition plan to really excel your results, head over to tailortoned.com. The link to that's gonna be down below in the description. I'm gonna stop talking. We're gonna get into the burn. Let's do this. It's amazing. It's so good, this one. It's towards me, you're gonna bring your hands onto your waist. Let's warm up. You're gonna roll the shoulders backwards and down. And then again, backwards and down. Now two forwards, forwards round, forwards round. Reach those hands to the sky. Big stretch, like you've just woke up. Inhale, exhale, lengthen your limbs. Maybe lift the eye line a little bit up. Drop the hands down to your side. Now stagger your feet wider, wider than your hips. Take your toes towards me. You're gonna take a big bend of those knees, knees over the middle toe. Let's go side to side, change, go change. So you don't have to look at me for this bit. You can just track side to side, soften through those knees, bend down. We go side, yes to side, go side. Now I want you to really connect with your body. Keep your hips nice and low. So we are not going like this up and over the rainbow no 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 we are staying low and low and low so really warming up the body the joints and the lower body and the upper body as you reach over with that hand side to side side lunge keep the hips nice and low hips are going across on a straight line so no drawing a big rainbow with your hips just side to side tap over tap over let's get that body warm reaching that opposing toe You've got just 10 more seconds here. Reaching over, reaching over. So I'm just laughing at myself. You have just six, just seven, just five, just four, just three, just two, one. Okay, up to standing. Oh my gosh, I forgot to put the aircon again. It's fine, it's fine, fine with no aircon. You're gonna bring now your right foot under the hip. You're gonna bring this left leg to the side. You need to be able to slide your sock your toe along the floor. Bring your hands together, clasp them. This knee, we're gonna bend it. Middle toe, little toe, up and we press. You need to be able to slide the toe, lift and press. So you can either take a pointed toe like me, or you can go ball the foot and slide, but I've got grippy socks on. So you just wanna slide and bend this knee. So the only reason you're going down is because you're bending knee over the middle toe. Now don't let that knee cave in. You want the knee middle toe, little toe. As you come up, your body slightly inclines forward. Squeeze up and we press. We slightly, now maybe take a breath, that yoga intention, palms in. We go slide, we go up. This is four, we slide and lower. Lift it up. This is three. You're gonna slide, press up. This is two, then hold. Slide, press up one more. Slide, lower, hold. Hands in prayer. Now foot to the side, just to the side. Knee over the middle toe, slight incline forwards. Your bum now and your thigh should be burning. Bend that leg. Slightly open that heart. Keep those hands together. You're gonna give me a little tiny pulls down. Yes, press down, drop. Press drop, now abs in, hips are slightly backwards. We're sliding toe to the side, to the side. Imagine you've got a slider ha, on that foot. You got seven, seven, you got six, you got five. Other leg in four, other leg in three, two, one. <sighs> Lift up, left foot down, right foot out. Slide it down, yes. Lift it up. So you need to go either onto the side of the sock or side of your foot. Don't give yourself carpet burn. If you're on a carpet, lift all the way up. Move your sock around to the side if you've got grippy socks on and go to the bit where you can slide and lift. Knees go in middle toe, little toe, lift and press. Now don't do this. We're not going here. We keep the body upright and we slide. Lift up, press. Keep those hips to me, hips to me. 
knees going, middle toe, little touch. Up, we go, squeeze this is four, slide. Lift and press, this is three. Slide it down, keep going, heart to me. Two, you should still be able to get those eyes to me on your device. Lift and press, one more, abs in, straight spine. Little tiny press, down now, yes, down now. Little pulse, feel it burn through the thigh, through the butt. Little tiny press, down now. Down now, get those thighs working. You got eight, you got seven, you got six, yes, go five, go four, stand tall in three, two, one. Whew. Okay, stand tall. Run your hands down towards the floor, little hamstring stretch, and then run your hands out in front of yourself. One of my favorite moves at the minute, hands under the shoulders, we're gonna plank, round with that left foot. We're gonna plank, then twist the foot. Round, reach, down, push back, other leg, round, Extend, down. So you're coming in towards a little low lunge with that foot as you sweep it round and push it back. Come round, sweep, down, push back. We come round with the foot, sweep with the arm, down with the hand, extend. You've got this round, sweep it, down, push back. Six more, round, extend. Maybe take the eyes, two, this is five, round, reach, down with the hand, push back, four more. If this is too much for you, you can always just give me a little plank hold or drop those to those knees. Push back two more, go round, sweep it, down. Push back one more, come round, go sweep it, go down, push back. Now you're gonna bring that right foot round the outside just like that. So you've got the foot round, you've got those hips open, nice hip stretch. Then this right hand goes over the foot. This foot comes to the center of the body. Stay there, you can either hang out right there or if you want the advancement, lift up, bring your hands to a prayer, body stays forward. Feel the burn through the thighs. Draw your abs away from that front thigh. Keep that back leg extended, back toes tucked. You have just a yes, go seven, hands hit your mat. In five, in four, hands down, in three, two, one, hands down, foot sweeps backwards, don't collapse down, control it. Now bring that other foot round to the side. Have a little stretch and open of the hip to start with. The foot's round to the side, then shimmy that foot to the center, this left hand stack it round the outside. Knee is definitely over the top of that ankle for that safest option. You can either stay here for the modified version, one advanced, inhale as you exhale. Lift up slowly, press into that thigh. Bring your hands to a prayer, bodies forwards, abs are in. Feel that burn through the thigh. You've got stillness. We've got eight. Hands down to your mat in six, in five, hands down in four, hands down in three, hands down in two, one, hands down. Sweep that foot backwards, sweep back, tuck the toes, down dog. Heels go down, hips go high. Breathe in, breathe out. Walk your hands to your feet, you're gonna soften and bend through those knees and roll it all the way up. Well done. Made it to your first section, now into the next section. So you're gonna grab a hold of your chair, or come to your work surface, whatever you've got lying around. Bring your hands onto it. Bring your left foot, the foot closest to me, down to the floor for a mirror me. Hands are on that chair. You want to be full arms distance apart. Knee over the ankle, tuck the back toe up, lift up, you're in a lunge. Now the front knee is going to go a little forwards, drop the back knee, lunge, lift and press it up. So we go lunge it down, drop, lift it up, press. Lunge it down, drop. Lift it up, press. You, need to, you needed to have made sure you're full arms distance away. Knee goes slightly forwards, middle toe, little toe. Lift up, back knee, make sure it's in alignment with that back hip. Don't let it knock in, keep it in alignment. Drop down, press, yes. We lift it up, three more lunges. Drop down, sink, lift up, press. Two more lunges, we drop down, sink. We lift up, press, one more. We drop down, sink, we lift and press and we come halfway. Hold halfway, keep that lunge. Weighs equal between your front and your back leg. Can you drop a little low with that back knee? Yes, hold. You should be burning now. This is part of the workout, I'm not just talking for no reason. We're in an isometric hold, so it should be burning. If you're going anywhere, you're going one inch lower. Breathe in and breathe out, exhale. Now, from here, you should have been a full arms distance away, so you're gonna bring it forwards with the weight. Grab the chair, you're gonna bring the heel in and bring yourself forwards towards your surface, just like that. Now, little raises, up press, up press. Looking at the screen right now, like Gabby, 
Shut up. <laughs> Bring the body forward, you can do it. Bend the underneath knee nice and deep and kick the heel in the diagonal. A lot of people will do this, so let the hip drop in. Don't allow that to happen. Keep that hip open. Yes, we're on the diagonal. We're pushing through this glute. We're pushing through this hamstring. Is your lower body sculpting day? So really push with all your force as we lift, as we lift, as we lift. I know it's burning right. Bend that supporting leg. Don't straighten it. It's not about straight supporting leg. It should be bent. You have eight. You have seven. Safely back down into your lunge. Abs in. Tuck the hips. Go five. Go four. Tuck the hips. Three. Two, one, safely down. I know we're going down with the knee. Yes, lunge. Lift back up, press. Go down with the knee. So now your thighs, your bum on both sides should be burning. It should be shaking, that's what I want. Go drop down, now control it. No death grip on your surface. Control lower, lift up, press. Control lower, lift and press. Four more. We control lower down, yes. Lift it up, three more, I know. Control it down, lift it up, give me two. Control down, knee goes forwards over that middle toe, lift up one more, knee goes over middle toe, little toe, lift up, hold halfway, hold halfway, hold halfway. Bend that back knee a little deeper. Breathe in, tuck the hips, little. As you exhale, bring the weight forwards, front leg, it does not straighten. Come forwards, back leg lift point, little lift now in an arabesque. So, you stay there, do not move, just look at me side on. This is what we're doing. You're facing, hips are going ground. Up press, up press that toe. It's in line with that hip. Don't sway in towards this hip. You wanna pelvis in neutral, lift, squeeze it. Up press, yes, up press. Leg in, neutral, abs in. Tuck the tailbone, feel it in the lumbar spine. Drop the leg lower, tuck the hips harder. You got seven, six, this is five, four, this is three, lunge it in two. One, lunge down, hold, I know, I know, I know. Stay low. Can you drop that back knee a little lower? Now you're gonna slightly bring that body forward. Hands are gonna go into a prayer. We're gonna send it down, down, yes, down, and down we go, down, and down. Go down, bodies forwards, back knee is bent, back knee is bent, you're not doing anything unless that back knee is bent. Little press down, little press down, go 10, go nine, go eight to your mat in seven, soft surface in six, down to the floor in four, I know, three, two, one. Ooh. Sweep to the back, hands under the shoulders, knees into the hip. Wrist issues, make a little fist position. Just gonna move my mat so I don't slip. So on your soft surface, you're gonna tuck the toes. We're gonna lift the knees up and away. We're gonna push it back for two, then forwards for two. We've got this back and back. We come forwards and forwards. Go back, go back. We've got a mirror nearby. This could, could be so beneficial for you. I'm gonna do a few different impressions of what I see all the time. We are not doing this and then, oh, coming down, if pace was low. We're not doing this with the hips. Yeah, we're keeping the hips low, knees don't move. Hips go back, the thighs should burn. Hips push for two and forwards two. We push it back, knees don't move. Knees are two inches away from the floor. The burn should now be so deep through those front thighs. Ooh. Three more, can't do like a bear then. Push back, squeeze it, forwards two, push it back. This is no time for jokes, Gabby, it burns so much. Everyone screams at the screen. We push it forward, hold it, you go 10, drop the knees in nine, I know, go eight, drop the knees in seven, yes, go six, abs in, go five, drop the knees in four, in three, in two, one, Woo. toes together, open the knees. Lift all the way up. Bring your hands onto your work surface, your chair, toes together. Let's slice a surprise. Down, oh squeeze. Down, lift it. Toes together, open the knees. If you've been working out with me for a while, thigh surprise, thigh section. If not, I'm gonna go front on so you can see exactly what I'm doing so that you don't cheer. So toes are together, knees are open into this small V. You want to make sure your knees are on your soft surface, hips push up, then down. Knee injuries, you're going to move slowly, or just rest for this bit, or just go into that all fours hover. Doesn't feel good through the knees, it's pain, not burn. 
If it's a burn, hold on to it. If it's pain like a sharp shooting sensation up your knees, just don't do it. Just give me a little all fours hover and hold. Maybe go back to push ups. Come up, come down. Yes, come up, come down. Four more, lift up. Drop down, three more, lift up. Can we bring the hands to the prayer now? Lift up, lower down, one, lift and drop. Now come all the way up, toes together. If your toes are untucked, untuck them. Press your shins, your bottom of your feet to the floor. Hands in prayer, shoulders down. Now we're gonna drop your hips backwards and down. Backwards and down, yes. Hold there. You got eight, you got seven, yes. Let those thighs burn, go five, I know. Four, lift up in three, two, one, lift up, breathe in, breathe exhale. We're gonna drop the hips now, backwards, back to your toes, hips go to the toes, body stays still, don't incline forward just because it's hard. Now, we're gonna go a little tuck, under tuck. Again, if you've been working out with me for a while, we're tucking, if not, we're rotating hips under, so you wanna come, hips don't drop out, keep tucking. We're going hips under, under, under. Under tuck, under tuck, under tuck, under tuck. Yes, keep those hands in prayer. Under tuck, keep the heart up. If you're doing this, you are cheating. Lift the heart up right, hands in prayer. Tuck those hips, I know it kills right. You are out in a final 10. Go nine, go eight, you're out in seven. Six, you're out in five. Drop the hips in four, in three, two, whoo, one. Come onto your chest, come on towards your chest. My mat is wet. <laughs> You're gonna come onto the chest, bring yourself all the way down. Now bring the hands to 290s. You're gonna bring one toe in, quick thigh stretch release. Bring the other toe in, quick thigh stretch release. Now we're gonna go in towards a prone lying frog. I want you to bring your feet, <laughs> sounds so funny. You're gonna bring your feet, bring your feet, hip distance apart. Feet are hip this is fun, just like this. Then you're gonna flex the feet and you're gonna squeeze the heels together. Feet are open in a small balletic burst, small V. Heels together, push the pubic bone in towards your mat, your soft surface, and we're gonna try and go up with the legs, down again. Now you'll barely see me move. We're going up a little and down a little. Lumbar spine injuries or issues. Maybe don't take this one. Doesn't feel good here. It should be burning the whole back, including here, but doesn't feel good here. Again, it feels like a sharp shooting sensation in the back. Don't do it. We're going up with the heel, legs in first, feet in first, drop back down. This is for here. We go frog push it up, drop back down. You'll barely see me move, but my glutes and my hamstrings are burning. Go up, push on my back. We go down one more. You're gonna up, push, hold, up, push, hold. So knees are trying to come away a millimetre from the ground, that's it. Now we're gonna go one point, one flex. Yes, one point, one flex. Your glutes now, your hamstrings should be burning, back should be burning too. We go for a point and a flex. Four more, go point, go flex. Three more, go point, go flex. This is two, point and flex. One more, don't drop out, heels squeeze together. My knees are away from the floor. You might not be able to see it, but my knees are away from the floor. And now we're gonna try and go. Little pulse up, yes. Little lift, it burns. So right now my butt, my hamstrings, my back's on fire. I'm squeezing up and up. You'll barely see yourself move. Up, squeeze, this is 10, this is nine. Yes, feel the butt burn for seven, for six, for five, for four, yes, three, two, one. Woo, hands go round, lift yourself all the way up to kneeling position, tuck those toes, walk the hands in. Slowly and safely roll. If you need to, little cat cow on the bar. Little cat cow on the bar, breathe in, breathe out. Okay, now we're gonna go second side. So I'm gonna move my chair over here. If you've got the ability to do that, go ahead. Or maybe move your laptop, maybe not the TV, take it off the wall. <laughs> Partner won't be very happy. <laughs> I was just trying to tell the time workout and the TV just somehow came off the wall. You're gonna grab a hold of your chair, your work surface, or you're gonna switch legs if you're on that side. And you're gonna take two bends through the legs. Arms forward, remember you need that full extension. So the toe, lift the knee, let's go. We're going down with the knee. We're going up with the leg. We go down with the knee. Yes, we go up with that leg. We go down with the knee. We go up with the knee. We go down with the knee. We take it up, lift it up. Three more, go down. Drop it, go up and lift. Two more, go down. Drop it, go up, lift. One more, down. 
drop. Now lift and hold, lift and hold. Stay there. You're gonna bend that back knee a little deeper down towards the floor, legs forwards. Slight incline forwards. Bring your hands around your chair or on your surface, surface and bring the body forwards. Front knee is bent, it's bent, it's bent. Squeeze the heel in. We're going up, up, yes, up, and up, and up. If your lumbar spine is feeling it, especially after those frogs on the floor, I need to bring the body even more further forwards. I need you to engage your core. Draw your abs in, heels on the diagonal. You stay there, I'm gonna come front on. So from front on, leg is here, going on the diagonal, body's forwards, we're going up, abs are in, notice your shoulders slide down, notice that heel kick on the diagonal, don't sink into that hip like this, we're going strong core, hips in neutral, pulse it, yes, pulse it, pulse it, pulse it, keep that leg lifted, we press it, up squeeze, up squeeze, up squeeze this. 10, this is nine, this is eight. Feel that hamstring and that butt engage. Four, six, four, five. We're lunging in four, three. We're lunging in two. One, lunge down and hold. Arms go on again, drop that knee down. We're taking it down. We're taking it up. Yes, don't come all the way up. Take it down, it burns more. If we just come halfway and hold it. Go down, knees going forwards, up again. Don't let the knee roll in, you'll really damage this knee here. So knees go forward slightly out, lift and we press. Thighs on fire, boom on fire, lift it and we press. Three more, go down, go down, go lift it up. Two more, go down, go down, yes, lift it, lift it. One, down halfway and hold, feel the burn. Bring the body forwards. Now keep this knee bent, don't straighten it. Bring the weight forwards, hips to the floor. Little up with the leg. You can even relax this foot, makes it burn a little bit deeper. Press the leg up. Are your hips in neutral? As you lift the leg, be squeezing through this butt cheek. Have you got that knee long? Have you got the leg lengthened like a dancer? Are your hips square? So none of this. We're not doing this. We're in a forward folding series, so both the hips are down, chest is square, abs are in. You should be able to float the hands off the bar or the chair or your work surface and still continue the pulse. This is not only lower body, this is upper body, full body sculpts in two because you're really working balance upper body too to keep this pose. Up squeeze, this is eight. Yes, go seven. This is six. This is five. We're lunging in four. Kill lunging three. Woo, two, one. Oh my gosh, let's lunge, lunge, lift. Don't come up, only halfway. Shh. Lift and press, who's burning, who's sweating? Me, lift and press, in school. I was that kid. Me, I know the answer. Gabriel, let somebody else answer the question. <laughs> lift and press, four more. We lunge it down. We lift and press, three more. Now slightly forward so you tackle that glute even more. Lift and press, two, yes, long spine, abs in, drop down. We lift and press, one more, lunge it down. I am shaking so much, we come halfway, hands in prayer. Let's pulse it down. <sighs> Inhale, exhale. Find those deep breaths, find that burn. Back knee, can you get it lower? For a knee, can you bend it more? This is 10, you're out in nine, you're out in eight, you're out in seven, six, you're out in five, in four, we stretch in three, two, whoo, one. Okay, to the back of your mat, you're gonna touch the floor. Touch the floor, feel the stretch. Walk all the way out, hands drop down carefully, knees drop down. Come forward, shoot those legs out to me. Hook this foot over the top, sit tall. If that's enough for you, I'll be well aware. I'm well aware it is for some people. Stay there. If you can, grab this leg and you're gonna bind and pull. 